Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, al pavito si ha marchado, al pavito ya está aquí. Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, al pavito si ha marchado, al pavito ya está aquí. Hello and happy Music Monday with Mrs. Stoker. All right, today we have something really special to learn. So as you know, Thanksgiving is coming up this week and I have so many Thanksgiving songs, but I wanted to teach you one about a turkey, but we're gonna sing it in Spanish. So Spanish might not be a language that you know very well, or maybe your family knows Spanish really well and you'll probably say, Miss Stoker, I could sing that better than you. And that's okay, I would love to hear that. You might already know some words in Spanish. Do you know how to say hi in Spanish? You say, hola. Can you try that? Hola. And do you know how to say goodbye in Spanish? Say, adios. Try that. Adios. Nice. So we're going to learn this song today in Spanish, but I'm going to tell you the silly English translation first. So this song is called Al pavo pavito pavo. And pavo means turkey, and pavito means little turkey. So the first line literally says, to the turkey, little turkey, turkey. The second line says, to the turkey, little turkey, yeah. The third line says, the little turkey is gone. And the fourth line says, and now the little turkey is here. So, phew, the little turkey comes back. He's still alive. All right, so now let's try these words in Spanish. All right, so repeat after me. Al pavo. Try that. Al pavo. Say pavito. Pavito. And then we say pavo again. Say pavo. Pavo. So the first line goes, al pavo, pavito, pavo. Try that. Al pavo, pavito, pavo. Don't worry, there's not going to be a quiz on your Spanish at the end. It's only if you want to. There will be some other options for your response. The second line is almost the same. It says, al pavo, pavito, si. Try that, ready, go. Al pavo, pavito, si. So the first line, al pavo, pavito, pavo. Try that. Al pavo, pavito, pavo. Second line goes, al pavo, pavito, si. Try that. Al pavo, pavito, si. All right, now we're getting into the fun stuff. So, el pavito, try that, el pavito. Then it says, sia, and it kind of runs those two together. Sia, and then marchado. Say, marchado. So, El, pav, or el pavito se ha marchado. Try that. El pavito se ha marchado. So it sounds like this. El pavito se ha marchado. Try singing that. El pavito se ha marchado. Nice. You're singing in Spanish. And then the last line starts one more time with el pavito, about the little turkey. And then it says, El pavito está aquí. And there's lots of words that run together in that one. So you can see the ya está aquí, but the yesta kind of runs together and the aquí runs together. So it says, El pavito está aquí. Try that. El pavito está aquí. So, El pavito ya está aquí. Try singing that. El pavito ya está aquí. Excellent. So the first line, repeat after me. El pavo pavito pavo. Try it. El pavo pavito pavo. My turn. El pavo pavito si. Try it. El pavo pavito si. Then it says, El pavito si ha marchado. El pavito se ha marchado. El pavito ya está aquí. El pavito ya está aquí. 
You want to try the whole thing with me? You're like, no, Miss Stoker, I don't know it yet. That's okay. You can always rewind and practice it. But let's see how much you can get. I bet you can get the words pavo. It says it a couple times. Ready on al pavo. Ready, go. Al pavo, povito, pavo. Al pavo, povito, si. El pavito, si ha marchado. El pavito, yes, aquí. How'd you do? Did you get a couple of the words? Did you get all of the words? I bet my Spanish speaking kids out there nailed it. Good job. And they might send in some corrections. I actually recorded this whole song and I said the wrong word for marchado and I said machado and machado means tank. So I was singing about a turkey tank. That would be pretty funny, but that is not what I meant to sing. There's no, no turkeys driving tanks on our Thanksgiving. I hope not. That would be pretty crazy. All right, so marchado means left, the turkey left, and then the turkey came back. All right, so now we're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to play the game. And there's a drawing game, a tapping game, and a movement game. So you can decide which one you wanna do, and you can always rewind and try a different way and do them all. And for your response, you can draw me the turkey that I'm about to show you, you can show me the moves that we're about to do. You can do the tapping game that I'm gonna show you, or you can even sing me the song in Spanish as much as you can do. All right. All right, so here's how we're gonna play the game. <clears throat> so if you wanna draw this, you can. And I just drew my little fat turkey and I put five feathers on him. And then I labeled them with the numbers. One, two, three, four and five. And one way to play this is when we're singing, you can tap to the beat. So if I said, al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, al pavito si ha marchado, al pavito ya está aquí, una. And every time we sing this, we're gonna shout out a number. And I know a lot of you know how to count to five in Spanish, uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, but for this game, it's actually not uno, it's una, which also means one, it's just a little bit different. So we're gonna say una, and I actually landed on the number one when I said una, but that's not always gonna happen. So that's one way you can play, and I'm gonna show you that. But then another way is that when you land on a number, that means that's a body part that you're gonna flap, like a turkey. So the first thing you're always gonna do is marching your feet to the beat. So it would be Al Pavo Pavito Pavo, Al Pavo Pavito Si, El Pavito Si ha marchado, El Pavito Ya está aquí, Una. So I was tapping to the beat, I was marching my feet to the beat, but since I landed on a one, we're gonna shake something. So here's my list that I made of body parts. So if you think of the body parts that you have, some of them you can't really flap. Like I didn't put nose, cause I, I can't flap my nose. I can kind of flap my cheeks around it. I didn't put ear. I can't flap my ear. Can you wiggle your ears? Some kids can wiggle their ears. I didn't put my teeth. Can't flap my teeth. But I can flap my right arm. Can you flap your right arm? Like a turkey feather? I can flap my head. Or you could flap it like this. Oi. I can flap my hands. I can flap, oh, my left arm. And I can flap my hips. That's some booty shaking there. All right. So these are the parts that we're going to do for our game. So do you see? If we land on a one, we're going to shake our right arm. And then if we land on a two, we're gonna shake our right arm and our head, so we keep on building. If we land on a three on hands, we're gonna shake our right arm, our hands, and our head. And then we just keep going. But all the same time, you're tapping your feet. That's a lot of things to do. I think you can do it and sing Spanish at the same time. Psh, you got this, super easy. All right, let's try it. And I think I need some help from someone. Should I get, maybe I could ask Mrs. Stoker again to help me. Hey. 
Mrs. Stoker, will you help me? Sure, thanks. Except the name's Mrs. Broker. Oh, thanks. Sorry, Mrs. Broker. That's Mrs. Broker, apparently. Okay, let's do this. All right, I'm gonna get my pen and we're gonna tap it and sing this song. And here's what we do. After the first round, we're gonna shout una. Say una. And the second one, we're gonna shout dos. Try dos. And the third one, we say tres. The fourth time, we say cuatro. The fifth time, we say cinco. And on the very last round, we're gonna say pavo, pavo, pavo. And that means turkey, turkey, turkey. All right, so we're gonna get our feet tapping. And if you wanna try tapping your turkey with me, you can, or you can follow Mrs. Broker and do the motions. Ready? One, two, ready, sing. Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, al pavito si amartado, el pavito ya está aquí. Una! All right, we landed on that one, and I'm gonna color it in. So that means we have to do our right arm, right arm and our feet. You ready? And now as I tap, I'm gonna start on this number. We don't get to tap that one anymore. Okay, right arm and your feet. One, two, ready, go. Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, el pavito si ha marchado, el pavito ya está aquí, dos. All right, we landed on our five when we said dos, and our five is ooh, hips. Uh-oh, get ready for the booty shaking. So we have our feet marching, our right arm flapping, and our hips are flapping too. Here we go. You ready? After this one, we're going to say trace. One, two. Ready, go. Al pavo pavito pavo. Al pavo pavito si. Al pavito si ha marchado. El pavito ya está aquí. Trace. Oh, we landed on our two. And our two means head. Oh my gosh. So we're flapping our right arm. We're shaking our hips. We're shaking our head and we're doing our feet. You ready? One, two, ready, go. Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, el pavito si ha marchado, el pavito ya está aquí. Cuatro. Hey, we landed on cuatro and that means four. We landed on the four. All right. So our four means left arm. So we have our right arm, our left arm, our head, our hips, and our feet. And we're gonna say cinco at the end of this one, just tapping on that three. One, two, ready, sing. Al pavo pavito pavo, al pavo pavito si, el pavito si ha marchado, el pavito ya está aquí. Cinco! All right, let's fill in that three. We have our little turkey feathers all filled in. And the three means we add our hands. Oh my gosh, your turkey hands are going. Here we go. You ready? So I'm just gonna pat my turkey's little belly this time. And at the end of this one, we're gonna say, Pavo, pavo, pavo. You ready? One, two, singing, go. El pavo pavito pavo. El pavo pavito si. El pavito si ha marchado. El pavito ya está aquí. Pavo, pavo, pavo. Come on, come on, come on, come All right, so for your response, remember, if you want to draw me a turkey with your five feathers, you can. If you want to make a video 
of you trying the song, either with my recording or with you singing it and tapping the beat. If you wanna make a video of you showing me some of the motions that we did, or if you wanna just sing me the song or even speak, you could try speaking some of the Spanish words in this song. And I would love to see all of those. So either a picture or a video or just a note maybe about your favorite part. And I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And maybe if you're seeing somebody on Thanksgiving, you can try out that song for them. That would be pretty fun. All right. Bye.